What is up my crazy subscriber, this is Joe King Johnson before and today I want to talk about the new Call of Duty game called Call of Duty Vanguard. If you guys are not aware, this is a new total different game coming in for Call of Duty. I thought it was just going to be an expansion pack for Warzone, but it is exactly what it is. It's an actual full game. You know, I'm excited for that because uh, after watching the trailer, I'm thinking like, well, I'm hoping Sledgehammer Games actually did put more effort this time around because if you guys do not know, these guys actually made the last Call of Duty World War II game, and now we're going back to Call of Duty World War II again, but with the name of Vanguard. So, I am hoping this game is actually a lot better on the multiplayer side, but, you know, this whole trailer is actually about the story mode, so we really can talk about the multiplayer. Hopefully, in the future, we do get a full multiplayer reveal, so uh, I'm pretty sure that's coming up in the next month or so. So, anyways... You know, the story mode cutscenes, they look pretty nice, they look fantastic to be honest, because I have played the previous Sledgehammer games like Modern Warfare 3, I played the story mode, it was impactful, I played Advanced Warfare, it looked smooth as hell in the cutscenes and everything, and then Call of Duty World War 2, I did play the whole story mode, I literally have all the live streams here in my channel, and I'm telling you, they look nice, the cutscenes look very intriguing. I like it. I like it. I'm hoping this time around this game becomes a little bit more gruesome, a little bit more bloody. You know, get us into the trenches with the experience of the Modern Warfare game. You know, we've seen what they can do with the story. Imagine with this game. I'm hoping it's more interactive with the planes and the tanks and certain missions out there. You know, get us into the trenches. That's what I want. <laughs> get us, you know interacting with the game that's all i want to that's all i want to say about that you know the, the game better have a great story and everything because i know i love world war ii games world at war was pretty nice and world war ii it was very like you know if you guys saw the ending of world war ii it was very sickening but god damn it really i really I remember that that ending a lot so anyways so uh, this is pretty much the trailer, pretty much a bunch of cutscenes, and uh, we do see a little bit of, of the first person view perspective. You'll see it a few times in here. It's like around three or four scenes in total that you can kind of see a little bit of gameplay, but that's about it. You know, the rest of it is just a bunch of cutscenes. So it looks good, looks nice, but let's see if the game actually plays as good as it seems. So that is it. So I want to talk about today. Leave me your opinion. What do you think about the trailer yourself? So that is it. You can subscribe for more you guys want to see more call of duty in the future and by the way the open beta is available first on playstation so god damn i thought it will be available for both consoles at the same time